guys, this is Tanya with Delilah Design, and this is my boring plain Jane door in my studio that now looks like this. So stay tuned, and I'll show you how I created this pink ombre door. So let's get started adding some paint to the store. I'm pretty much using all DIY paint. Um, I love their reds, pinks, and corals. And especially when you put those colors together, I think it looks awesome. So on this project, I'm using Carnival Red on the bottom, which you see me applying now. And then I'm going to apply Kissing Booth, which is a fuchsia pink. And at the top, I'm going to use cowgirl coral i love that color so much and it's my most favorite coral out there so i'm basically just getting the base coat on this door but i'm still doing my separate colors the carnival red kissing booth and cowgirl coral at the top um, and then we will continue with on with our second coat up next Okay, let's get the second coat added pretty much in the same way, except I'm going to start blending the colors as I go by using a little mist of water in between sections. When I start to add the coral on the very top, I'm going to use quite a bit of water. I'm misting it before I apply it and then even after because I want the cowgirl coral to drip down into the kissing booth to create these drips and to blend it a little bit with the kissing booth. Also at the very top I'm adding a little arctic white because I want that very top part of the coral to be even lighter to give it more of a, a blended ombre effect. So up next I'm going to add the IOD transfer sea queen. And I'm just adding it on the top section of the door. So because my door has a lot of different ridges and uneven areas, I applied it in the beginning to the raised section right in the middle. And then I used my fingers to hold the transfer in place and press it down there. And then I moved outward from the center. This method allowed me to press or adhere the transfer down into the recessed areas and then to work my way over to the more raised area on the panel. In the details and on the bottom section of the door, I use Paint Couture Gold Metallic Paint to add a little drama. Okay guys, thank you so much for watching. This is the very first time I've had my own creative space and I'm having so much fun making it my own. Please hit the subscribe button and the bell to be notified of my next creative project. Until next time, thanks for watching.